In this video, I will be showing you how to easily route the Amazon Fire TV on any operating system. Let's get started. First of all, you want to go over to Settings, then System, click on the About page, and make sure you are on a compatible software version. I will leave all the information in the description of this video. Next, you want to scroll down to Network and copy the IP address. Last but not least, you want to go into Developer Options and make sure ADB Debugging is enabled. After that is done, you can just leave the Amazon Fire TV alone and we'll head over to the computer. On your computer, head over to the link in the description to download ADB Fire. From this website, you can download the program for Windows or Mac. After you download ADB Fire, download BusyBox also in the description. And once you have those two files in your downloads folder, go ahead and open up ADB Fire. If you're on Mac, just drag it to your Applications folder. If you're on Windows, just double click the .exe file and install. After you have the application installed, go ahead and run it. On a Mac, click on Open. And if it doesn't open the first time, go to System Preferences, Security, and then you will see something pop up here saying Open Anyways. Once you are in the application, you want to write down the IP address we took from the Amazon Fire TV, just like I am doing right now. Next, you want to hit the stop button, and then you want to hit the start button. You'll get a message at the bottom saying ADB running, and then you can go ahead and click on connect. Now it says device connected. You can now click the root Fire TV button, and you will get a message saying installation successful. Hit OK. And now before we leave this program, go ahead and install BusyBox by hitting install APK, navigating to, to the location of BusyBox, and hit yes. In a couple seconds, you will have BusyBox installed. And there you go, hit OK. And now we can head over to our Amazon Fire TV. On your Amazon Fire TV, you wanna go to applications, manage all installed applications. And the first thing you want to open up is towel root. Launch the application and click the Make It Rain button. And that is it. We are now rooted. No need to reboot or anything. Just hit the Back button. And now we will launch Super User. Hit the Continue button. Normal. OK. And then hit No Thanks. Now you want to go ahead and back out of this. And now we will finally launch BusyBox. Here you want to quickly grant user access. Hit the back button on this page. And finally you can go ahead and hit the install button to install BusyBox. If you get a message saying successful, you are good to go. Hit the back button and now you can exit BusyBox, we are done with it. That pretty much concludes this video. If you found this information helpful, hit the like button, subscribe for more content, and stay tuned for more videos on what you can do with your Amazon Fire TV.